she's got it and more. I'd recommend it to anyone. Lovely. Brilliant. Unbelievable. Amazing. Very funny. We just loved it. What more does one want? Service. Oh, incredible. I, I love this. is the, my best pants I've seen in years, without a doubt. They made it. They made it. Oh, it's amazing. God. Taking up quite enough of my time. It's bad enough I have to address you in rhyme. The thing is, I see her as such a serious showbiz girl from daybreak, and now <laughs> I see her oh, I know. flirting with Sam. I know. <laughs> Hello there. Sam's hot. Your dick's hot. <laughs> you belong on one of those makeover programmes on TV. <laughs> what do you mean, how to look good naked? <laughs> no, scrappy challenge. This is definitely Possum's the best panto in town. It's got a 3D bit in the middle and it's got some very rude jokes, which only the adults got. It was fantastic. I had such a good night. It's a lovely, lovely evening, all matinee and I would advise everybody to come and see us. I am loving your frock. Is it, is it George Armani? It is, and yours, I presume, is George and Asda. I, I laughed until I cried. We're laughing all the way through. It's great fun. I have to say, the comedy, the lineup, everything's brilliant, and the choreography stands out a mile off of a lot of other pantos. Good taste? Day Maiden's not meant to be in good taste. Day Maiden was magnificent. Absolutely got it, absolutely got it, Possums. It's a once in a lifetime opportunity and I'm the person that's doing it so I'm really pleased with that. Well we're having a whale of a time so as long as everybody else is then we've done our job properly. And in theory if we do, the audience do as well. We put the pastry on top of the sausages. <laughs> Let's face it, Sarah the Cook who is played by Eric Potts just has the audience in stitches as well. It's a really great panto. Come along and see it. Seriously, come along and see the show. I enjoy it so much because the kids have a lovely time. The audience has a wonderful time and it transmits itself back onto the stage. As long as the kids get the story, the adults get the jokes, and that's what it is really. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, I didn't see him down here. And there were bells ringing out your name, Dick Whittington. Lord Mayor of London. She's been extraordinarily quiet. No temperament, no problems. So, touch wood.